Hello everyone and welcome to A Slice of My Life. It is mail call time from Olight. Yes guys, another package. Now this one honestly is a pretty big box but I think that the item inside is a small one. But before we crack this package open, I want to put this little guy here in the corner and uh, this is actually a gift from my buddy Samson. You guys have met him before. He gave me two of these little gacha cats, like teacup cats and I think that is so cute. So this is gonna be our kitty companion for this particular video. All right, let's crack the package open. Here we go. And this right here is, whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait. I was not expecting this. Okay, this is cool. This is really cool. This is the Olight i5T EOS in a really special colorway. This is what Olight calls the Stardust colorway. And I gotta say from the picture here, it looks really, really cool. Now this is going to be a limited edition piece and it is going to be part of a special flash sale. The April sale is coming. Yes, guys. So first of all, I want to say thank you Olight for sending this my way to take a look at. I mean, it's really, I really appreciate it. Also, I want to thank Mora because without Mora, none of this would be possible. And of course, Mora always says, I got to thank Leah. So Leah, thank you to you as well. So guys, of course, in a later part of this video, I will be sharing with you more details about the April flash sale. But if you are impatient, you can always check the description box because I'll put all the details in there. But let's just take a look at this i5T EOS in the limited edition Stardust colorway now, shall we? Now, the first standout thing about this particular box, I must say, is that there is a slight texturing to the box here. So this is a little bit different, but also interesting at the same time. It still looks very premium in the very trademark Olight style. So on the side you have this five-year warranty promise and then you have the QR code here and on the other side you have a barcode on the bottom is this on the top is that the Olight branding and on the back here it gives you some specs of the i5T EOS it is a flashlight that is powered by a single AA battery now of course I can list all of this on screen so I won't be talking to you too much about it now let's move on to the unboxing experience now of course up here there is what looks like to be those pull tab things. I don't know what you call these, perforation lines? It's not really perforation, is it? Like, okay, whatever. So it's just a kind of like a pull tab. There we go. And we move that. And this pops open up here. Then there is another tab here. Wow, that's really well thought out. I don't remember the last time I saw an Olight product with this tab here, but that's cool. So out it comes. And that's straightforward enough. Nothing else in the box and you are presented with the i5T EOS in that beautiful Stardust colorway. Now, definitely look at this. Okay, on the package, it looks cool, but the actual product looks way cooler because it's like a metallic treatment. So these blues and these whites feature this metallic finish or this metallic coloring, and I love it. Looking as well on the pocket clip, it looks to be anodized blue. I don't know what material this pocket clip is. I'm going to assume it is stainless steel. I mean, someone or an expert out there would probably correct me on that. And here it says, read me before first use. And on the back here is what looks to be an instructions manual. Yep, a user manual. So I'll just put this right there. And it says I have to unscrew the tail cap and remove an insulating film before I actually use it for the first time. So if I'm not wrong, it's all going to be operated via this tail switch here and I'm now going to quickly browse through the user manual to take a look at the operation instructions. Okay, I've gone through all of that and it looks like the operation is very straightforward, very much like Olight's i3T EOS as well. So before we open up the tail cap, let's take a look at the aesthetics of this thing. You have the model number here that looks to be printed on i5T EOS with the serial number or the model number and then up here there is some grooves here or some jimping here and it's really really smooth now this is possibly the smoothest jimping i felt on an olight torch so far then it's got the double helix kind of grooves in the middle of the body and this provides you a really good grip now i understand what ting Su felt when he was holding my beautiful brass i3t <laughs> okay it's no longer mine i'm not going to call it mine but yes um i was not able to really experience and enjoy that but now i gotta say yes i'm happy that i can actually experience this and wow, I love this. Look at that. These grooves actually kind of fade away. Let me try and hold it in an angle where, uh, you know, possibly you could see it. Or maybe I'll just adjust the light. Uh, there we go. So this might help. See how it kind of fades off? Well, that's really, really nice. That's well done, Olight. Okay, let me just re-angle the lights very slightly so it could benefit the video, I guess. Sorry guys, I, I didn't really mess with the lightings much. Anyway, this here is the removable dual direction pocket clip 
and I love that it is anodized in blue. The blue here on the pocket clip is slightly lighter than the blue on the body, the blue accents here on this particular Stardust design. But I gotta say, this is very close to the old light trademark blue color, you know, branding on point. And then on the bottom here, of course, we have the LED, the light source. Now I'm going to unscrew the tail cap. That feels good. Wow, okay, so internally, it looks like this part is made of copper. So I have to be careful with that. I know you guys are probably like, you're a wuss, but yeah, you know guys, I gotta take care of myself, right? So that's the film that you wanna remove from the battery compartment. And we have a double A battery. It looks like there's some lubrication on this. Okay, uh, yeah, just taking a sniff at it, it is lubrication, so it's not that the battery is leaking. I just needed to confirm that. Let me quickly wipe it down with a little bit of tissue paper because, you know, it's going to be slippery. And it looks like we'll be putting the positive end towards the light. And now we just screw the tail cap back on. And yes, guys, what you see right there is an O-ring, very nicely lubricated, which means that this is waterproof rated at IPX. Eight. Okay, let me just shift all of this out of the way so I have a little bit more real estate. And let's talk about the operation right now. Operation is really, really straightforward. All you got to do is just click the tail switch once and that turns it on. This is at the 15 lumens mode and then click it once more to turn it off. Now, if you depress it halfway, you could actually have a momentary on, a momentary off. And if you want to switch modes and you want to go up to the next brightness, it's going to be turn it halfway and then quickly depress it again there we go this is the 300 lumens mode guys and then click it to turn it off and it will always turn back on in the low light mode by default because you don't want to be randomly accidentally blinding people right but if you click it twice really quick then you go into the high mode. Oh, you know what guys, I had to take a look at this just to be sure because I did not want to give you guys the wrong information. Take a look here at the specs for the high light mode settings. It's going to be running at 100%, which is 300 lumens for the first three minutes and then dropping down to 50% and running then for 25 minutes and subsequently dropping down to 10% and running for 122 minutes, which is already pretty darn awesome. And at the low light mode settings, it's going to be running for 20 hours guys for a single double a alkaline battery what in the world this is awesome so going back to the light itself guys looking at the form factor this is rather small now let me bring out the penguin that i used to unbox this whole thing and you could see it is smaller than a penguin let me just also grab a lighter so that i can properly use that for a size comparison and look it is just slightly larger or slightly longer i should say than a lighter so it is going to be super pocketable and this thing actually packs a punch especially in terms of the efficiency you get out of a single double a battery guys 20 hours runtime what in the world from a single double a battery okay so the form factor is pretty good overall ergonomics is definitely good as well if you don't like this pocket clip you can remove it on top of that there is a little slot here where you can actually tie a lanyard if you want to it's got a very simple straightforward operation via this tail switch over here click on click off nice tactile feedback as well oh yes guys if you were to switch modes within two seconds then yeah it changes the light modes but beyond two seconds it goes back to the low light mode setting and it's also really simple and straightforward to change out your battery and to top it off this thing is also rated at ipx8 i mean <laughs> what can i say right what can i say really awesome product small pocketable very good for your edc that's what i'm gonna say about the i5t eos by olight now at this point of time guys i'd like to take the opportunity to share a bit more detail about the april flash sale now this flash sale is going to be happening from 8 p.m singapore time on the 19th of april that's a monday and it will run all the way till 10 a.m on the 21st of april which is a wednesday so monday to wednesday guys now listen the free gift for this round is going to be an s one r2 or s2 r2 blue clip you gotta add that to your cart manually but it is a free gift some of the cool stuff the limited edition stuff that is going to be featured during this sale as well as of course the first one is going to be this guy over here the stardust colorway of the i5t eos but you also have and i wish i wish i think i'm gonna get this one too it's a baton 3 premium edition meaning the one with the charging case in 
orange guys in orange what also there's going to be an m2r pro warrior in the ocean camouflage color as well as a warrior x pro in the desert sunset colorway now of course you can enjoy all these sales without actually using my affiliate link or my coupon code but i just want to let you guys know that i do hope that you will still use my coupon code and affiliate link even though using my link and the coupon code will not be getting you an additional discount on top of the flash sale discounts already but at least it lets olight know that i sent you guys there so i really hope that you will consider doing that however if you miss out on the flash sale or if you're watching this video at a period of time when there are no flash sales please go ahead take full advantage of my link and use my discount coupon code because that will give you a 10% discount off your order. That's right, for any item that is a non-promotional item or a non-discounted item, you will get 10% off. So yeah, I want to say that I actually tried this out myself. If you use my code during any flash sale period, but you intend to purchase a non-promotional item together with those on sale, you'll still get that 10% applied to the non-promotional items. However, sometimes there may be some kind of small bugs. I don't know, like bugs in the system, but I've already given this feedback to Olight. I think one word of advice is if you're intending to do that, meaning to say if you intend to purchase some regular items along with those promotional items during the flash sale, you want to first of all be using my affiliate link. Then you want to add the regular items into your cart first, applying the discount code so you'll get 10% off those. And then after that, go ahead and add all the flash sales items that you want to get that's what i did the last time around i don't know if they'll be able to fix it on time this time around but i sure hope so anyway guys if you're already using the link and the discount code thank you so much because it really means a lot and i said this just a moment ago but by doing so you're letting Olight like know that i sent you there and that of course helps me back in return so thank you so much for all the support now at the end of this video i want to give a shout out once again to Olight to Olight Mora and to Olight Leah. Thank you so much for sending this my way. This is a really, really beautiful colorway. Once again, everyone, this is the Olight i5T EOS in the limited edition Stardust colorway. If you like the content that I'm putting out and you want to see more, please consider subscribing to the channel if you're not subscribed yet. But if I did not earn your sub today, that's okay. I will continue working on my content and the quality overall. And hopefully one day I will earn that sub. On top of that, another great way to support the channel is over on Patreon. I'll put a link up here to that. We do have patron exclusive content as well as patron exclusive giveaways from time to time. So if you do become a patron of mine, thank you so much in advance. And that is it, everyone. Thank you so much for sticking all the way throughout and sharing in this slice of my life. I'm really thankful that I have this to show off to you guys. Make sure to make use of my affiliate link and the discount coupon code. And I hope that you buy something awesome during that flash sale that Olight conducts every month. Yes, guys, I'm actually giving you a hint now. Olight conducts these flash sales every month. And I will catch all of you in the next slice. Bye.